All right, so I just shut down the forge. It's Sunday, 6.30. Um, I've been working on a project that Robbie started. Forge is cooling down. Um, it's this right here. Um, that started out as a piece, ooh, that's hot, as a piece of bar about that long. Came from this guy here. Somebody cut the end off of a crowbar and we used like four inches of crowbar, maybe five, to do this. Now, Robbie started it, my Robbie, he's 15. Um, look at that, that would work just like a, a third hand. I had no idea. Well, I just figured something out while the video was going on there. If I take this, put this over here, it's hot. I, I thought that looked like a third hand, but like it would work like a third hand. But you take this here and you put it down on your piece of metal. Hold on, bear with me. Just bear with me here. This is a trick that, oh see that's in there. That is a third hand, but I don't even have to mess with it. I'll tap it out. Watch out. Well, this is the other piece of that crowbar. So if I wanted to pin that down with a, the so-called third hand, you'd take that, put it on there, give it a tap. And then that is not locked in there at all. That pins that like a vice almost. It's funny the way that the hardy hole works like that. There's, anyways, that just ruined my video because now it's too long. So I will start a second video on the actual knife. 